meeting in Manhattan today involving Iranian President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad and a group of Orthodox rabbis who actually praised him. CBS 2's political reporter Andrew Kurtzman was there and had exclusive access. It was a meeting out of the twilight zone, an Iranian president who wants Israel wiped off the map and a dozen rabbis who couldn't agree more. CBS 2 gained exclusive access to the event held at the Intercontinental Hotel in Midtown. There, President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad railed against Zionists, meaning the Israelis. They have no respect for the lives and the dignity and the properties of Jews. If they could, they will destroy six billion people in the world. And then he made a chilling prediction about the future of Israel. But their time is ending. And these rabbis who believe Israel's founding violated God's will couldn't have been happier. God should give you a long life and health and strength and not to be intimidated by the attacks of Zionism that is attacking you as being anti-Semitic which is a pure ploy of Zionism to intimidate people that they shouldn't speak up against their, their illegitimate state. The president once again questioned the existence of the Holocaust, and the rabbis, some of whom lost relatives in the war, suggested it was all a Zionist conspiracy. The city's Jewish groups told CBS2 the event was a travesty. The mainstream Jewish groups are calling this meeting an obscenity and a charade because these men represent nothing. Can you respond? <laughs> Why are you asking this question from me? You represent Jews? I represent WCBS TV. But he never answered the question. The rabbis represent a group called Jews Against Zionism. Many of them hail from the Orthodox communities of Brooklyn. The Iranian president was so pleased with their comments today that he invited them to come visit him in Tehran.